Let's head up to the monastery and see what's going on. Would you slow down? One of Benny's goons could be up ahead. Come on, we left those clowns in the dust ages ago. Oh my god! That's disgusting. Oh, I wish I had my camera. So what? The Spanish booby trapped the island to protect their gold? This wasn't made by the Spanish. Take a closer look at the spikes. You have got to be kidding me. This is from our plane. Wait, that doesn't make any sense, though. Why would someone set traps like this when their own men are crawling all over the island? They wouldn't. Something's been here since a trap was sprung. Something or someone? Do you think Shh. that... Do you hear that? Hear what? Nothing. Absolutely. We're being watched. Watched? Yeah, y you know what? It's probably nothing. Um... Let's just get out of here before we run into whatever's been chewing on this guy. Okay. sights. and Navarro can't be far off if they've left their attack dogs at the gate.
Go ahead. I want the library secure. Don't let them get to Sullivan. Yes, sir. They've got the old man working on the east side of the complex. I don't even know where they brought him along. That son of a bitch can't be trusted. Nate, I've got a bad feeling about this place. No, no, me too. Let's just find Sullivan and get the hell out of here. Now! Over here! Huh? 
Nice job! Here, I'll hold that while you brace the gate open. Okay, let it go. Gently! Ah! I said gently! Oh shit. Oh,
Oh boy. in this little bar in the Philippines. Oh, man. She had a smile that would melt your heart. Bro, I swear to God, she just as soon kill you as kiss you if she caught you stepping out. Just a wee bit of a thing. She couldn't have been much more than 4'11". They called her the spinner because she... Will you shut this... up, old man? You told us that one a dozen times already. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> of course I did. Memory's not what it used to be. What the hell's taking you so long anyway? Well, maybe you hadn't noticed, but most of these books are half rotten and written in Spanish. Yeah, we'll hurry it up. The boss is waiting on you. Hey! Up there! Ah, oh, crap. Watch out! Hey! Damn. time you showed up. <sighs> well, 
You're looking awfully good for a corpse. So you brought the girl after all, huh? The girl? Hey, if it wasn't for her, you wouldn't be getting rescued right now. If this is a rescue... What the hell does that mean? You gotta admit, Sully, this all looks a little shady. Yeah. I mean, you tipping those guys off... And miraculously showing up alive? Now, wait a goddamn minute. Roman had a contract out on me. I needed to buy some time. All right, stupid mistake. I didn't realize they'd try and track us. Sully, we would have been headed home with the treasure by now if you had just for once kept your mouth shut. And you might have thought of checking for a pulse before running off and leaving me for dead. Look, none of that matters now. All right, so how is it you're standing here breathing and all, huh? <laughs> you are not going to believe this. No way. <laughs> Old Francis took a bullet for you. Yeah. I thought this kind of thing only happened in the movies. Yeah, well, it still hurt like a son of a bitch, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I bet. Anyway, once they realized I wasn't dead, I convinced Roman that they would never find the treasure without me. So I've been trying to mislead him ever since, waiting for you to show up. Well, where are they now? Well, they're chasing a little red herring I sent him on on the other side of the monastery to get rid of him. <laughs> Look. Drake had it all figured out. See, that's the symbol the Spanish used to mark their secret vaults. The treasure is hidden right here in this monastery. Find the symbol, and we, we find, find the, the vault. vault. We have everything we need right here. All the clues to take us right to the treasure. We can do this, kid. <laughs> all right, you boys aren't gonna get all chummy and leave the girl behind again, are you? <laughs> Don't even think about it, Sully. She's got a mean right hook. I'll keep that in mind. There's more to this room than meets the eye. I'm sure of it. Hmm. Something about these statues. Okay. No, that's not right. Try checking the diary again. Ah! 
Come on, hurry it up, Nate. We don't have much time before they realize something's wrong. Another library? Huh. What now? You know, this looks familiar. The inverted torch leads to the land of the... Wow. This looks promising. Here, let me see that. Yeah. Okay. You two sit tight. I'm gonna check things out. Whoa, wait, no. You're not going out there alone. Yeah, Roman's men are swarming all over this place. Yeah, and one person will make a lot less noise than three. Come on, I'll be fine. And you guys will be safe here. They don't even know about this room. Okay, take this with you. Leave it on channel 13. They don't use that one. And keep us posted. All right, you got it. Close this thing back up. Yeah. Nate? Be careful. <laughs> Come on. I always am. Ah! I did not see that! Ah! Okay, land of the dead. Here we go.
He's here! <laughs> Something about this. Nice. Two bells resound in perfect harmony. clues right here we can do this kid how the hell does he think he's gonna get that statue out of here anyway This is completely unacceptable. What do you expect from me, Roman? My men are getting massacred! <laughs> I find it hard to believe that one man could wipe out your entire crew. Ugh, it's not just Drake, goddammit! I'm telling you, this island is cursed! Enough. Take your sorry mob and go. Wait, you can't cut me loose. You owe me a share of the gold! Your share, Eddie, was contingent upon you doing what I required. You assured me that Drake was captured and the island secure. Oh, this is bullshit, Roman, and you know it! We are done here, Mr. Roger. I 
Stay camel. <laughs> My dear Jello. See you then. Remind me again why you employed that superstitious idiot. You wanted someone cheap. <laughs> well, you get what you pay for, I suppose. And what about you, Navarro? Are you worth what I'm paying you? The vault's here. I'm sure of it. If Sullivan can be trusted... Which he can't. Look, he knows we'll kill him if he's lying. Don't be stupid. He knows we'll kill him once we find the treasure. He has no incentive to tell the truth. Really, Navarro, sometimes I think you left your brains back in that slum where I found you. I just need a little more time. Chasing this treasure of yours is proving to be more trouble than it's probably worth. I assure you, El Dorado is worth more than you can possibly imagine. <laughs> it had better be. <laughs>